Hi all, welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another travel vlog. Hope all of you are healthy and safe. Recently, we were invited to the wedding of our family friend's daughter at Malapuram. So naturally, the video is all about the wedding and some beautiful places we visited over there. Hope you all enjoy the video. Keep watching. Bahardapura was a soothing experience after our long ride that started early morning. And this is the view of Bahardapura from Mini Pamba, a hold for many of the Shabarmala pilgrims. The wedding was so different from what we usually see with warm reception, peaceful ambience and of course delicious food. After the wedding we planned our next stop at Nlambu which is about 70 kilometers from Kutipuram where we were for the last two days. Both Kutipuram and Nilambu are parts of the Malapuram district and we reached Nilambu by evening. On the way, we came across many boats indicating forest zones and animal passages. Our first idea was to visit Canoli's Plot, which is the oldest teak plantation in the world on the banks of Chalia River, but we are disappointed to know that the hanging bridge over there was destroyed in the floods and under renovation which is the only access to the plantation from the mainland. So we changed our plans, took some photographs and moved to the old DFO Bangalore which is nearby. Make it last forever. Stop inside.
The bungalow is located about 2 kilometers from downtown on the top of a small hill surrounded by serene woods. The building was the district forest officer's bungalow and now maintained as a tourist attraction by the forest department. There are plenty of doors and windows but doors to some rooms are closed and entry to some portions of the bungalow is restricted. The staircase and flooring are made out of teak woods and windows are of Belgium glass. I find it engaging to visit old palaces, forts and buildings. We get to know about their lifestyle and ways of entertainment. But sad to say that the bungalow hasn't been maintained properly. Close to the bungalow, this is Skywalk. Steps leading to the forest is a special experience. Nilambu Teak Museum is the world's first teak museum and the only one in India operated by the Kerala Forest Research Institute. The museum is of great historical, artistic and scientific importance and provides a lot of information on teak trees. From embryo stage to degradation, the teak wood that survived the test of time for more than four centuries, the insect associates of teak plantations and whatnot, everything is shown with great detail in this museum. Teak equipments of older times, which find space in some homes too. Really a comprehensive museum to know almost everything about teak trees. The Bioresource Nature Park associated with Teak Museum is a visual pleasure too. Through the waves cut through me, hypnotized by the sounds I'm breathing in. Hold tight, hold tight, chemicals collide. Hold tight, hold tight, hold tight. Dripping lights paint the skies all because.
Kapte Nilambu. Our journey continues to Uti and I will upload videos from our Uti segment soon. And with that, here I am winding up my video. Please leave a thumbs up if you like my video and please do subscribe my channel if you haven't subscribed yet. We'll meet you with the second part of this video. Till then, bye.